Where's North from here? Alright trainers, I'm Summer Northern Guy and while I wait for my ride home from work I thought I'd share with you my predictions for this week's Pokemon Direct. Quite the obvious one to start with, I think we're gonna get to see some new Pokemon from Generation 8. Probably the early root Pokemon, you know, like the regional bird, like the Pidgey of the region, the, uh, the, the what are they called, the Route 1 rodents I guess, the, you know, the Rattata of the region. Um, and maybe just a couple of random ones, we might even see the Pseudo Legendary's very first stage, but I think we're going to see, I want to say about five, at least three, but I, I reckon five. And to go hand in hand in that, I think we're going to see some more older Pokemon coming to the Galar region, just like we did in the reveal trailer. Now, with this being so close to E3, I think we're obviously going to see the uh, release date, a confirmed actual date, not just like november um and probably the box art as well and from that maybe the box art legendaries if they're putting legendaries on the box art now even though this is a 15 minute direct i don't think we're going to see anything really big or in a lot of detail they'll probably spend maybe at least five minutes talking about the history of pokemon and how we've got up to this point they seem to do that every major pokemon direct but we still might get to see some new mechanics uh, maybe teased maybe not explored in a lot of detail um then again we might do they've been really really quiet with the information for sword and shield especially compared to sun and moon so hey, maybe we might get everything in your face in one big 15 minute direct. I think there's a good chance we'll get to see the Galar region's professor or professors as well. Maybe the rival and maybe and hopefully a gym master. And I wanna know more about these stadiums and how they work. If we are gonna get anything big, I, I like mechanic wise, I think it's gonna be the stadiums. At least I'm really hoping it is because I just wanna know. It, I'm still confused, man. I need to know. And speaking of the stadiums, there's actually a scene in Detective Pikachu right near the start, so it's not really a spoiler. It's a promotional video for Rhyme City that Tim watches on the train. And in that video, he sees Red battling in a big stadium against a trainer who looks like she could be a gym master. Um, and she has an Arcanine and a Gyarados, so maybe we're gonna see dual type gyms in Galar because I think Detective Pikachu is set in the Galar region. You can see a video about that in the iCard and in the description. And the final thing I think they're gonna show off is trainer customization. We know it's in the games, that's already been confirmed. They had that designer t-shirt competition where the winner actually got disqualified. Um, but maybe this time around, or hopefully this time around, it's a lot bigger, it's a lot better. And if it is, then I reckon now is the time to show it off. Regardless of what we get, I'm really excited. This is the time of year I love when we have E3 and we have the big Pokemon news with a new game coming at the end of the year. I love this stuff. So let me know down in the comments what you think we're gonna see in the Direct on Wednesday. Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel to see more content from me, and share this video with a friend. Also, it'll be interesting to come back after the Direct and see if my predictions were right. Click that notification bell to make sure you never miss an upload and you can connect with me on these social media platforms. I'll see you in the next video but until then keep training and have a good one. See you later!